All right, let's get through this nightmare. Hey there, one of the Zaug Alvin Sire rivals starting. Is that, wait, I can change. I unlocked an outfit for you, right? Is it a suit? Yeah, leather. Oh boy. Well, you got that now. Playing as silver. Let's see how the line up. Just leather suit. Just looks like what Rubonic is wearing. So, silver. Yeah, it's very important that I'm here on Onyx Island. You. Whoa, and Shadow's here too. I don't know who you are, Black Hedgehog. Yeah, I'm saying you to do a thing, so you gotta do it. And there we go, that's our intro. Silver the Hedgehog. You could argue that I could use this as an opportunity to, like, do some of my alternate plans to how to handle the series. I did- I'm the one to get hurt there. I don't get that. Alright, well, like, you know, like, the idea of maybe doing a supercut or something, but I feel like, you know, I did the rest of the game as one full run. I should probably do the rest of the game that way. And alternately, um... Why am I the one that keeps getting hurt? Weird. Alternately, I forgot what I was thinking about, but that's fine. Oh yeah, you know, maybe I could try to like... Oh, there we go. Psychokinesis. I don't know why that stopped you, but here we go. And uh, I was thinking of something else, I don't know. Yeah, also, I considered maybe trying to split this even further, well, uh, even less. And like try to do this in two parts, but honestly... I gotta think about my mental health, man. And, uh, whoa, I got exploded. And then you're- oh, Hey, I'm glad that he actually started running backward. See, when you see something like mess up the controls, uh, I'm always a bit curious what that exactly means when we're talking about, like, the computer being affected. Because the computer is not playing the game the same way we do. Although, considering some of the strange issues it has navigating like, stuff like, oh, why are you over in front? Please get frozen. Uh, while I, you know, like, the computer, like, sometimes gets stuck in, like, um, in, uh, loops and whatnot. Oh, this is no good. I do wonder how the computer handles the other character. Right, it's your turn to be stunned. There we go. I even bopped you on the noggin. Yeah! Pressing the button when I touch a log. That's how I live my life now. Look at that. Shadow on the ground. Wow, you jumped it. There we go. I did a homing attack. I didn't just land on him. Like, I actually pressed the jump button again. A second time! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Alright, we're just gonna tag each other like that now. Ah, oh, shoot. No! I hate Putin in this game so much. Oh, come on, dude. Watch it. Really? What? How did... What? No, whatever. Use a projectile version of the ice. Great, we're at this part of the level again. Is he just gonna win again? Is he seriously just gonna win again? He got stunned there like an idiot, and I won because of that. I won because the computer made a mistake and ran into a robot the same way I would. Do I feel good about this victory? Not in the slightest. Have this card of chaos. I don't know how negative Eggman got a photo of that, but he did. Mystery! Uh, well, I didn't get my fast boost, so here we are. See, this is why I try to jump over the robots more often than not, rather than kill them, because the, the computer does run right into them. Which I appreciate. Alright, this is, yeah, these are so awkward, always. Alright, well, yeah, don't try to use your attacks, because that's what happens when you do them. Okay, here we go, guillotine time, I don't know what's going on. Oh, please go away, Shadow. Thank you. I got psychic powers, you can totally tell. How did I mess up that much? I don't know. Okay, well, uh, really? Well, you got the thing. Wah! Homing attack. You ran right into that spider. You did it. And then the music went, ugh. 
I'm just following you. Like, I'm not gonna go faster if I go... If I just do the same thing. Yeah, here we go. Way in the face. It's gonna happen. Alright. Oh, I'm in front now, somehow. I'm gonna put ice here, because I think it's in a path that you have to take. Yes, he's all frozen now. He's full of frostbite. He's gonna die. All thanks to me! Green Zone! Victory! He's got stars on his face and all over the place. Got a fire! Um, yeah, I just lost my fire shield, so I had to put a new one back on. It's a decision! I mean, I kind of understand, honestly. Is this a place where we go? Well, I'm gonna put ice there, on like a somewhat automated section. I mean, you never know what that's really gonna mean, but I did get a little face as a victory. Please go away. Alright, here we go! Whoa! Fire in the shield, fire in my hair! And then I'm just kind of going overshooting the ramp thing. That's the kind of thing we're doing. Uh, indeed, that says the song. Okay, I'm still something. Well, I'm protected with fire. So, like, if shenanigans happen, I should be fine. Like, that's what that means. Like, if he, like, just runs into me or something. I keep doing like the exact opposite uh, effect that I want, but I feel like I'm getting good results regardless. So maybe it's a suggested retail button to press. I don't know, it's silver! He's got his wadding boots, he's got his plumber gloves, uh, he's ready to fight a monster. See, the issue with silver, and the reason why he's a bad idea, conceptually, is that going forward, any other time you want to use him in another game, like here, you have to... Wow, they just point that out immediately with him, huh? Okay. Like, you have to involve time travel. Like, you don't have a choice. Time travel has to be part of the story. And if you start to have to invoke time traveling all the time, I mean, then, like, the whole series just constantly becomes about time traveling. And all that because of one character. So it's either don't use them anymore, or sparingly, I guess? Like, I mean, sparingly is probably the right answer. Like, you know, like, the overuse of Friend was a uh, mark against the series for a while, after all. I mean, I like all the Friends, personally. Like, they're mostly used... Really? You managed to get a hidden? Well, that's just great, Shadow the Hedgehog. There we go. I got a second hand then, though. I don't think you did that yet. Oh, but you did now. I don't want to lose a boss fight. Like, that would be just the worst feeling in the entire universe. Like, I cannot think of a worse setup for a punchline that doesn't go anywhere. You're gonna run after the head, but no, yeah, at some point he goes too fast and you gotta run counter and do that instead. Right, that's just a smart thing to go. He's like, whoa, check it out, I'm hungry! Give me that piece of cabbage! And it's like, yeah, a silver one. That last hit was on purpose. And silver's winning animation is really, really uh, involved. I keep unlocking various chaoses, but sometimes it's the same ones too. Oh. Oh. Well, all right. I guess I'll do that. It's Sonic. Okay, but I gotta defeat him. Attitude. Whoa. Is your name Blue? Well, do you have no reason for that? You're just saying that because the game is made that way. Don't claim otherwise! Oh man, Sonic made in front of me. Whoa, no! Don't use the powers! Okay, I heard a bird squawk though. That's pretty fun. Alright, uh, uh, I pressed nothing. Dang it! Sonic, stop it! You don't need to use those. Oh my gosh, this is the worst thing. Alright, well, oh yeah, I mean, that makes sense to put it there. Power of the sun! Help me out, sunshine! And cure me of this disease! Oh, that's a bird, that's not a spring. I, I, yeah, I'm very good at interpreting sprites in this game. They're never sprite, but you know what I mean, like objects in the environment. Oh, whoops, I was supposed to put something there. I thought it was a button. 
But no, it was a QTE object. It just keeps happening. Ah, I'm running here. See, jump over him to give Sonic a chance to get hit. You know, that's what you want. There we go. Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm gonna put an ice here right before the ramp. Then I'm gonna fall down to just get back up. And I'm gonna jump over that QT object. No real reason for it. It's fine. Alright, hey, it's Sonic. The Hedgehog. Use the hog with all the edges. Uh, Alright, well, he seems to have gotten himself stuck somewhere. I'm not gonna complain. I'm gonna push down this column. That's right. And then bop a thing? Yeah, bopping things is an important part of a well-balanced breakfast. He's in front of me somehow, so that means he's gonna get all the rings. That's how it works. Oh, and I feel like when the camera pans out a whole lot like that, I feel like it makes you realize how little impact the boosts actually have. Yeah, I hit you with my melee! I did that. I hit you with my fall over on my face attack. I don't know, like I pressed that button to go faster, but I don't know if it led to faster. Whoops, I just jumped because I saw that pit. Yeah, welcome to trying to react to things and paying the price constantly. That bird went squat. That's pretty rad. I love squat. I didn't see the power up in time, so I couldn't really, like, jump to get it. By the time I could see it and press the jump button, it was significantly too late. Like, I, I just wasted my motions there. Emotion, motion. Right, please stop, Mr. Sonic. And I'm not seeing a little sun effect, like a little star effect side art. So I have to assume that my thing just missed? Like, did it just miss? Did you, did you just not get stunned? Uh, and here we got this long, yeah, this long nonsense catapult, and I just lose, and it's like, I hate this game. Every time I lose, I never feel like it's my fault. Which is, I know it's a bad attitude, but I just literally never feel like it's my fault. I'm not back, uh, Did I lose because of this? Because I mistimed my homing attack and he got an opportunity to boost way ahead and now I'm just never gonna catch back again? Well, I managed to froze him there. That doesn't seem to mean much. No, he's gonna catapult and he's gonna win! Wow, fantastic. I'm in love. Really? He's just gonna win again? Like, I used my green thing, he was not affected, and then he bops me- oh, this- I hate this! Alright, well I got here at a catapult first, which means that, like, with still, like, uh, a little bit of bar left, it still means that I won. It's, oh, it's, I am, I, I, I just, I just want to be done for today. I am, this is not fun. This is completely ridiculous. There's the egg hornet. Please enjoy this delicious hornety meal. We got a second one to do now. Oh, everyone calm down your Giuseppe machines. Oh, I have nothing to say. I just, I just wanted to see this level 5,000 times. Well, we get to see it uh, 5,001 time. Whoa, did you see that? I ran rent that robot. Oh, the mastery in display when I got hit by that lightning bolt. Hey, see, that's what you want to do to mess up with the computer, but uh, I, I feel like the chances you get to do something like that are so slim. And, you know, some people will call me out and some of my nonsense, and sometimes, you know, there are things that I can do that would push things more in my favor, but I don't know, I feel like those times are so rare, it feels like. Gosh, why did I jump? Because I saw these polygons on the floor, and I was like, well, there's polygons on the floor, better react. And I get punished for it. I guess just constantly when I feel it's happening. Like, I, I, I'm I just not able to react fast enough. I react fast enough to tell something is here. So then I have to make the decision. Like, do I run into it because it's a gate? Do I try to jump over it because it's an enemy? Do I press a QTE button because it's a QTE thing? 
And I, you know, sometimes I use context clues to tell me what it probably is, but that is not fail-proof. And sometimes I'm just wrong, and you know, it's, it's gonna happen. That is gonna happen. Please hit that icy lip. No, Sives is going through. He's completely or ignoring me. Like, his unique power is so good. It's like you get just invincible and you go forward real fast. Like, it's so good. And now he's just laying eggs on the ground and I died. And I lost. And I hate myself. And I will kill. Kill. Murder. Kill. Fire! Jesus Christ, why- I- I- Why am I having so much tr trouble compared to before, though? And like, it's always space exactly where I can't do anything to a stupid piece of garbage. Eh, yeah, did he win? Oh, he won! Wow! What the fuck did he Ring it out! Oh, he got up there, so that's cool. And he won! Wow! Foobity boo ba da boo I'm having so much fun! I could split myself in half and die in rot! No! Ha ha ha! What? Ah! Ah! He can do it, and then of course it's when I'm at a hill, so I slide down a thousand miles. Mange la cri! How many times? Of course, he gets a star while he's in front. Like, that's rad. Love it. I don't even know why you got hurt there. No! But, okay, no, that was a fireball. It wasn't him. I thought it was him under a star. Then I won. I don't know why I did different. I hate every. I just want to be done. I just want to be done. This is why I'm not doing three. Because I think I would throw myself in front of a truck. I'm being exaggerated. I'm sorry about the style of commentary that is coming out of my mouth zone. I can't help it. I'm sorry. I do do mean it. I pile wall. They're saying stupid garbage. That's stupid. Wow. Fun. Hilarious. Whoa. A boss and I hate to fight regardless. So, this version of this fight is gonna be great and fantastic. You know what? I'm just gonna stay silent for the rest of the video. I'm just, I don't wanna, I don't wanna commentate this way. I'm just, last things I'm saying in this video right now. See you guys tomorrow. Have a great day, please. Have a great day on me. Spinning animation looked like it was like that on purpose. <sighs> He's a boss real quick. Someone put a chef hat on chaos. That's pretty funny. So he knows how dig a hole and bury his head in it. Knuckles here. What? Swim camera gets Zeus Flubber. Guys, I should play Sonic Rivals and it's Tyree because of the story. The story is extremely worth watching.